I saw this video of two Karens going batshit insane for like a minute straight. I feel like I need to share it with you guys because, you know, I'm a very considerate, passionate, and shareable person. I want to make sure I share as much as I can to the community. So, let's watch this video. Get out. I could be annoying. Oh, I don't care. Go. Out. You already called the cops. You need to go. We've already called the cops. Get, get out. Get out. You're not welcome. Get out. Okay. As you can see, the Karen had a whole battle cry. Man, I'm not gonna lie. When I saw that, I jumped out of my seat. I was absolutely petrified. I was very, very scared and. But no, on a real note, I don't know what's wrong with her. I don't know why she's screaming like that. It's actually, honestly, it's actually pretty embarrassing. <laughs> like, I mean, I maybe she's on drugs. Maybe she's not mentally there. That's like my first assumption whenever people act like this. Like, whatever she's on, it's not okay. It's not right. And honestly, it's pretty annoying. I can care less. I can care less. I can care less. You met me again. What a beautiful duet these two have. I swear, it's like nails to a chalkboard. That's how beautiful it really is. Again, it's really embarrassing. It's straight up, the best thing I can compare this to is two dogs barking at each other because they don't like each other. Maybe, I don't know, they're in each other's territory. I'm actually pretty curious about the backstory with this, but honestly, it's probably that. Hang on, I'm actually gonna predict what happened. I think one of the Karens took the other Karen's seat. And the Karen did it like that, so she started yelling, and then the other Karen started yelling back. And now they're in a whole temper tantrum. Or you know what, maybe maybe they just cut in line. I don't know, it could be something as little as that, that could start a huge ass argument like this. I can confirm that she's on drugs because there's she started dancing, hopping around when, I don't know, maybe the chick's husband stepped in and asking her to leave. Maybe that's a worker, not in their employee outfit, but whatever it is, that backhand fist was, it had nothing. It, it had nothing with it. That backhand fist was easily the weakest, wettest thing. I, what? That backhand fist was the weakest thing I've seen. If you backhand Mike Tyson like that, do you think you're going to be taking him out? That's going to be the type of punches Jake Paul is going to throw at Mike Tyson. Uh, this chick is barking at her again, and she's hopping around like she, I don't know, maybe she found her owner. I can't believe certain people like this are actually real. I can't believe, like, they're actually functioning. I can't believe, like, they're actual real people on this planet. Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out! Oh, you know what? That was kind of misleading. That was an employee right there. The other chick yelling at her. I don't know, maybe she's still Karen. I don't really know what happened before that. Uh, I don't know. All I know is that she did not need to yell back at her. She just, I don't know, kind of embarrassed herself with that. And the bald man saved the day. I don't know, I, I actually feel like she's on drugs. I could be wrong. Maybe I shouldn't assume stuff like that. Maybe that's fucked up with me. But maybe it's not. Maybe I'm actually right and she's in an, a whole other Dunkin' Donut just screaming at people. Uh, yeah, that was really the video. Moral of the lesson is if you're mad at someone, don't start screaming at them and tell them to scream at you back. And if, you, they, and if someone does that to you, please do not scream at them. It won't end good. And yeah. Uh, thank you guys for watching. There's nothing else to be said. So goodbye. <laughs>